Hey everyone, it's Nelson Miller here with PA Creative. Today I have a really quick tutorial showing you how to add an icon to the accordion module when the item is open. So this actually is not a feature in Divi, I'm not sure why. Um, in fact, they've added it to the toggle module for the open and closed state, but not for the accordion. So I'm gonna show you that and show you how to add it here. So I actually am going to show you the demo here right away. Uh, this is the toggle module. So if I open it, you can see there's still an icon right here in the corner. Same as, well, it's a different icon. It's hard to see. It's a plus icon and then a minus. Um, but then with the accordion, this one you can see is open and there's just no icon there at all. So again, if I open a different one. So that's what we're fixing. We're, we're adding that uh, icon that's missing for the open one, all right? So I hope that makes sense. Now, it's, it's really easy. The first step, we're just gonna add a custom CSS class, and I have that described here, but basically, you could copy this and then go to your website, to your accordion module. I'm gonna just get in the builder here. All right, open up the main module here, advanced tab, open the CSS ID and classes toggle, and right here, paste that in, or you can write it, PA add accordion icon. All right, and while I'm in here, I'll just point out in the design tab, there's an icon toggle. And you can change the color. You can see it's changing it there. And you can also enable this, use icon font size. So watch this, you know, if I make this bigger, it changes. And um, it's actually going to apply these settings, this color and this size, to the one that's going to show up as soon as I add the code for it. All right, so I'm just pointing that out now that you can adjust that. Um, now the next step, we've added the class here, remember. The next step is, is just as easy. It's this snippet of code and it's very short and simple. I'm gonna copy that. And you know what, while I'm in here, I'm just gonna go to the page settings and that way you can see it right away. Um, in fact, you can see that I've used a minus icon and I added this right here in the code and that's one of the built-in icons that come with, with Divi, they come built in. I'm gonna show you the blog post for that. I have a link there. So you could scroll down here. These are all the icons. So if I, you know, if I wanted um, uh, like this one here, this one would be number 42, take the number at the end there. So I could I could replace this, say 42. See that? That's totally up to you. Um, it, you know, it's a great idea to do. I, I don't really like the, the plus and minus, but there you go. You can uh, replace the icon. And actually, while I'm thinking about it, is there an icon picker in here? You know, it's not here. Why was I thinking it was? Hmm, it's, there's no icon picker. I'm just now realizing that. Over here in the toggle module, look at this, they've added, and this was in the icon update, the, the one that was like 2.12 or 4.12 or something. See here, look, closed icon. Um, I could pick that one. Um, and then again, you could change the color. And then look, open icon. Let's say I pick that one, so watch this. Oh, sorry, my uh, grammar checker tool was, is getting in the way. All right, so there, I got rid of it. But anyway, see, I can even change the, the size. Look at this. I can change the size for the open or closed. Look at that, that's really nice. Um, looks like I, wait, yeah, I can change the color too. So that, that's great, but we can do that in our code as well. So let's do that for the accordion. So think about it, if I have, this one's open and I've already added the, the I already have the selector. So just go in here and say, color green, you know what I'm saying, whatever. And now the open one will always be that. See that? And I mean, by all means adjust the size, you know, font size, I don't know, 32 pixels. You know what, that's not gonna adjust unless I say important. 
So you can actually see that I've, I've changed the font size. We're kind of um, replicating those settings that Divi forgot to add to the accordion module. They just literally added them to the toggle module, like seriously, like really recently, but they did not add them here. I guess they forgot. If you're watching this on YouTube or something, you'll need to come over to the blog post, copy the snippet, of course, that's what we always do. In fact, I even talk about that, choosing your icon and color and size. And that's all there is. Hope you enjoyed that. I actually have kind of a little series of toggle and accordion tutorials coming up. So be sure to check those out. Uh, be Stay tuned here on YouTube, be subscribed, and then on our blog as well. All right, well, we'll see you all in our next video.